Okay, welcome back to round two with the elephant. Open cage. Shoot. Shoot elephant with blowgun. Okay. What the hell? Why isn't this asshole dead? Okay, we're gonna try this the other way around. We're gonna shoot him first and then open the cage. Maybe he'll like, it doesn't take effect right away and he can still run. Okay, open cage. There he goes. Numbers off in the direction of the stream. All right, all right. He slows down, eventually stops right in the middle of the stream. All right. Thanks a lot, you stupid elephant. Oh, look at that. He's like, Durr. Well, these graphics aren't actually that bad. For, like, their time period. Like, this is... Probably better than a lot of the NES games. In terms of visuals. So, I mean... I remember reading the manual for Hugo's House of Horrors earlier, and it was like... Uh, uh, did I go the right way? I think I had to go where the elephant was. Anyway, it was like you need like 40 kilobytes of RAM and like a hundred, no, one megabyte on your system to play this game. And a hard disk is not required, but recommended. It's like, okay. I remember the game, the computer I used to play this on had a text editor that was just like a blue screen that you typed on. It was high-tech stuff back then, children. Do I go this way? Could be somewhere I gotta go. Hmm. First one, you had to go where that river was below and cross. No, you had to go through the waterfall. That's what the guy said to me. Right, right, right. Okay, well, that was just a waste of time walking around, but... Yeah, like I said, we actually managed to beat this game back in the day, so... That was a pretty good accomplishment. Yeah, you go through the waterfall. There we go. We cross over these stones. Use stepping stones. Yeah, okay, there we go. Mm. Ah, get water. Fill, fl fill flask with water. Fill the flask with the magical water. Alright. And then we gotta go through the old man's cave, I think. Because, um, the old man's cave... Which is over here, I think. Yeah. Well, the evil spirit... Okay, what do I have? What do I have in my inventory that could scare him off? S golden bell. Ring bell. Ding, ding. Sure. That spirit. The power of Christ compels you! What am I supposed to do with the bell? Look, spirit. Huh. Use crystal ball. Use crystal ball on spirit. Look at crystal ball. Here's cloudy. I gotta have something here. Some pins, ball pipe, crystal ball, reed squirrel. Did I read this? No, I already read the squirrel. Clay, water flask. Jesus Christ, I don't know. Ring bell, ring gold bell. Okay, what the f- Okay, well, we'll come back to that later. Um... Let's go explore the village and the surrounding areas, I guess. Look. Which is doctor to the right? A wild beast. Okay, well, nothing to do with that. Checking the witch doctor's hut again, see how he's doing. I also see a golden candle. Ooh, I can get that then. Candle. Okay. Go check the elephant, I guess. Right here. Mouse is gone, that's cool, I guess. 
look. Whoa! Old worn book. Get book. Okay, sweet. Uh, read book. Various spells, okay. Well, the muscle's back. Well, I guess he's just pretending to be a rock over in that little corner the whole time. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the cave. Read book. Gather the bell and the candle together, read the spell from the page. Whoosh, the beard's gone. Good, fuck off. Oh, it's an old man. Give Chris. Oh. Okay. Question game. Right. Uh, hold something in the hand. No, it's not an elephant. Jewel encrusted egg. No. Yes. Splendid, you win. Go upward on yonder rocks and you will emerge on the path. I've never seen my crystal ball. Okay, cool. He winked at me, that's creepy. Right now I just took the secret passage back, so uh, let's go save Penelope. Give Penelope water. Actually, let's first have sex with corpse. Eh? Okay. Give Penelope water. Revive our sweet Penelope. Um, trip merrily back to the plane, fill it with gas in the spare tank. And you get gas in the spare tank the whole time. Okay. That's convenient. Why don't you just sit there by the plane, put that in, and fly away? You're like, God. <laughs> Let's hope they make it home this time. Yeah, me too. I hope so as well. Okay, well, that was fun. Well, you can send $20 to David P. Gray at that address. Okay. Well, that was fun times, guys. Uh, I'll see you next time.